stem is going to terminate within the hull. Now you're going to need to cut into the hull so that the stem pieces fit in within the same thickness as your cedar strips. Another thing you should do before attaching your stem is just take your rats and with the rough edge just rough up the stem of your canoe. This is going to give it more surface area for the epoxy to, to grip into. Gotcha. 
attaching your rudder stem, screw it in place, starting below the water line and working your way towards the shear line. Line it up as precisely as you can, and you'll need a screw about every six inches. Remember, the more screws you put in will mean that you'll have more marks or holes to fill where the screws are, but on the other side, the more screws that you 